very heavily with Charlie, it would be very difficult to do. I have a persuasion plus nine. It doesn't uh, matter. Do I have to call back over the camera to get to the other side? Yes, please. And oh, welcome oh, back, everybody. It doesn't everybody. fucking matter Matt. because you don't know how Matt. the tower's Matt. supposed to work. Matt. You can't persuade a beholder, period. Well, no, you can persuade no, no, a beholder, no, but in this campaign, you. probably not. No, in this campaign, you're not able to, period. Yeah. And welcome back, everybody. You know, Amazon production. I thought we were going to take a break, fuckhead. We did. We stopped for a second. God damn, I was going to go get a drink. Well, what do you want? Turn it off! No. Okay, then you tell... Josh, don't pour it on the floor. Pour it like a normal-ass person. Stop sucking your own nuts. Pour it like a normal person. Damn it. Huh? Pour it like a normal person. Be confident in your pour. Uh -huh. If you pour like a little bitch, you'll get it everywhere. All right, what do you want to drink, Alex? I wanted you to go pour me some of that watermelon. Then I will. And you just kind of explained to me what happened last episode. Yeah, so last time we fucked Charlie's plot point over because he was a little dumbass. You destroyed an entire city! I mean, how Poor was I city. supposed to know that Charlie underfunded the fucking military of that city so much that they couldn't have put down a measly young black dragon? I mean, seriously. It's shameful. Yeah, it was just a black dragon. Uh, a young black dragon. It's not an elder black dragon or an ancient one. I don't even think elder or ancient is on that list anywhere. Because I think I, I think I thought they were too hard. No, there is. But well, not. There's a few ancients, but there's no elders that I see. Anyway, so yeah. We were about to turn and leave this now charred, war-torn hellscape and go, well, maybe at least just look at the tower. So you're outside of the city, and if you look on the map, see that spot right to the right of the edge of the city, that little tower sticking up? Yeah. That's the tower. Are you fucking kidding me? That thing right there. You mean, yeah. You mean that tiny little measly tower? Uh-huh. You would think somebody would have done something about that. Well, I mean, who wants to go find a beholder? No, I mean, seriously. All they would have had to do is roll the catapult up on the bulwark up there and fire a big damn rock. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, um... Are any cannons still alive? No. No, oh. no he, he took care of them. <laughs> <laughs> took care of that. I don't see how that baby dragon destroyed it. All of it, like most of it, yeah, I could agree. He he would be able. Well, to a young him. black dragon isn't a baby. Yeah. yeah. A young black dragon's about a hundred years old. Imagine if we talked to elder dragons and destroying that. That I don't even think we'll be able to walk in. All right. So, are y'all climbing the tower? Uh, no. No, we're, that we're just so looking small. at it from the distance. All right. So y'all looking at it from the distance, and then what? Well, I mean, we're trying to perceive what it's like, you know. It's I mean, a straight up like straight methods up of entry, uh, what's its ma make, uh, is there any inherent Weak flaws points. in the construction? We're trying to figure some shit it's out. An old, us nothing. It's an old stone, kind of almost, not necessarily a crumbling, but cracked stone tower. Mm -hmm. It's in a circular, so like a cylinder, mm -hmm. all the way up. Yeah. Um, there's just an open doorway that goes straight into the center, and there's a spiral staircase going all the way up. To a room on the top where there's a few windows. Is there any mm. rooms? Any rooms in the tower there was at one point, mm. but they've done all been dispelled at this point and have no and are no longer existing. Are there any forests nearby? Any sources of wood other than the burning city? <laughs> no. Mm. Actually, forest is actually a thing on the map. Uh, I use so. <laughs> no. Yes. No. 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 Um. Hmm. Well, my first thought was we could just build a fire at the base and just... I mean, you do have a burning city. Well, the problem we is we down. need enough fuel to burn it. I have a lot of pot. That's not... That's not I have super. a hammer. That's... I make you all the pot new. Actually, that may work. I also have a hammer. Uh, right. We would have to do a check to figure out enough about um, architecture to destabilize the tower, though. It's a giant cylinder with just a staircase going up. There's and nothing else supporting but, it but the outer walls. I, I, I know. Floor. In other words, if he were to take that hammer of his, 
and smack a few different bricks out, it would all come. Theoretically. Yeah. I also have hammer. Are y'all pancaking it? Are we... I mean, burying a beholder under a few tons of rock would be pretty nice. All right, well, I want to see this happen. Okay. This will be pretty. Uh, uh, let me see. I have sure. a normal hammer. I'm not talking about a war hammer, just a normal hammer. So you think I... that'll be good enough to help? I have a regular hammer, oh, too. Apple war hammer. Pretty much any hammer, anything that could cause damage to the building. Right? Okay, I have a war hammer. Think about this. Fireball. Wouldn't that do a lot of damage to it? Probably not, no. Oh, it is a no, stone. No, here, let, let's, just, let's just break some bricks in first, and then you can shoot a fireball right into the door. All right, I will help because I also have a hammer. I use okay, then, I so I guess we should uh, roll some strength checks. Sure. Ah. I'm looking for 12 or higher. Or I have six. I have okay, 16 you're, you're plus gonna five. Laugh. I have 21. 12 plus 2. 15. Uh, okay, you pass 13. 21. 15 plus 1. 13. Okay, 21. 13. You pass 13, then you, you cause damage to the tower. Okay, so, in 16. other words, we've knocked a whole bunch of bricks out the bottom. I, the tower starts to kind of shake a little bit. A few pebbles start falling, almost like it's starting to crumble, but it hasn't started yet. Up. And it has stopped. It, it settles down and then stops. Okay, then. Well. Uh, I tell the two guys, come on, let's back up, fireball right through the door. All right. Kind of like, this is not going how it's supposed to be. Not at all. Y'all have actually completely made how I'm going to have to do after this as well a little challenging. Yep. All right. Because y'all killed the people that were you're supposed to talk to. <laughs> hey, at least we figured out, at least there's one guy. I mean, hey, it can't I be didn't... traced back to us. We, we aren't responsible for dragons. I know. I use fireball. Six. six. I'm gonna plus seven. I'm gonna use my Eldrix plus ten. Okay. So it's definitely a hit. All right. So you hit him down in the dead center of the inside of the tower, like on the center of the floor. When it explodes, it shoots out all of the bottom bricks that were remaining in an outward um, direction, and the whole tower pancakes down <laughs> into the center. I say, get ready, and I and I take a battle stance. I turn around because cool guys don't look. Yeah, as, as the tower pancakes, you see the beholder kind of burst through the roof, and a piece of stone falls on him, and taking him all the way down to the ground. He is now pinned under a little bit of rubble. So he's knocked prone. He's pinned down and is extremely badly damaged. I jumped in that blue swam. Is there any? Uh, like, oh, that's not good. Yeah. You're gonna beholders are like deadly, man. Yes, but he's pinned down and... It doesn't mortal. matter! He's got those eye tentacles with death lasers! I can... Yes, but he's mortally wounded, too. I can... I jumped and shot my hammer down his... Roll for strength. Are we... Shouldn't he have to roll for an issue? Acrobatics. Mine is Alex? 19 plus 15. Okay, is... now roll for acrobatics, too. I grabbed the four. Four? But my attack is so, so high. You, you try to jump, but you don't really get off the ground, so you just kind of end up running at it, and you hit the hammer down on top of the rock that's on top of the beholder, causing it to push down even more. Now the beholder is trapped within the stone. Okay, I want to use my second blood attack. Start coming out. I want to use my second attack. You gotta be ready to do that. Uh, yeah, he's not ready. You see blood start seeping out of the rocks after that rock goes down. Okay, I wish I wanted to go in wave mode. And that'll be in my I mean, turn. I'm just preparing for her attack. Um, Double tap this person. I was hoping that was not obvious. obvious. What? I was hoping that was obvious, but okay. What was obvious? That ain't the beholder. No, the description I just gave after the rock fell. It started bleeding. You mean he's dead? Thank you. Finally. So double was tap. a brain! No, double oh, okay. tap! Well, I mean, just because something's bleeding doesn't necessarily make no, it. No, it's like seeping out. So and okay. I kill the beholder. So, it, okay, both of you shot. Okay. You and you help me lift this rock up. Let's see if he has any. Or at least the eye of the beholder. I help lift up the rock. I just lift up Wait, the rock. Gonna need roll roll type. We're gonna need You never okay. tell us what type of beholder. I lift the steampunk beholder. Right. There's, no steampunk city. there's no such fucking thing. I don't think there is. There is. I, oh I, I actually have a picture oh of Oh my god, god, this is going to be awful. Wait, have I seen it before? I no. think I have. No. Uh, yes, no. actually, you have. You're supposed to draw it. Wow, yeah. that is dumb as shit. This is from the book. Wait a minute, why would it bleed? It. Don't <laughs> question me. 
<laughs> it's oil. The eye is bleeding. Okay, fine. So Let's roll, roll some strength. Okay. 16. I got, I got, I got, I got, I got 11. Okay. Yeah, all right, so all together, y'all get the rock lifted up. And pushed to the side. Yes. And there's the, the beholders just flat. Okay, well, I finished that thing off. I really. basically pick up its carcass and. You grab, you pick it up by the tentacle and it like falls off the tentacle? No, no, no. By the cage thing. Oh, by the, like the body. Oh. Yeah, and I. We well, do that and like all of the tentacles just kind of fall off. Okay, that's fine. He's still got a central eye. And I put it up on the back of the triceratops. Okay. I almost forgot about that. Yeah, we haven't used it all episode. Yeah. Alright, so then I, um, I, I heard that triceratops thing. inventory. Yep. And that's fine. Uh, beholder's mechanical eye. Uh, just the carcass. Beholder carcass. Sure. About the tentacles. Mechanical one. Please. Was there any use for the tentacles? No. No. Okay. Not at all. I. They're, dis- they were just like solid and stuff. So I uh, destroyed the thing. Huh? Wait, that was actually the weakest beholder in this entire. Yes, yeah, so I kind of figured. You take the so I, and then y'all killed it while even fighting it. Yep. So I suggest we. I give up with y'all. I I give up. I quit. Well, I mean, you're the one who put it in a shitty tower like that right there. When there's that big, impressive tower up there. He could have had the whole town under his control. The big, impressive tower was the lab. He could have had the lab under his control. No, because they they weren't really concerned with him because he wasn't altering nothing. So, as you are going back through the lands, which way y'all heading? Well, I just... We're heading towards... Castle. The castle. Yes, to tell the All king right. we've killed the beholder so we can go back to doing something else. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Just watch. All right, right. y'all get to the end and y'all see the livestock is still warped and corrupted. Has not gone back to normal like it should have. Whoa, whoa, whoa uh, excuse me. It could have been an Um, whoa, what, excuse me. The beholder y'all are after is the one that has warped the livestock and crops. What livestock and crops? Cows, chickens. You never said anything about You never this. said anything about any of this shit. The king just sent us on this quest because uh, he heard there was a beholder up there. We didn't even know anything about the livestock no, and no. crops. Why would we care? Because y'all are being punished for releasing a beholder that has warped the livestock and crops to the point that they're unedited. You didn't tell us this. You just said we were... In trouble we were accused of releasing a beholder. And that's it. Well, I guess I need to review the video because I thought I did. I, I was probably too occupied with Noah talking to, yeah, you know, and all that, yeah, and distracting me. So that that that's that's the reason. Okay. So if I didn't say, I'm sorry. Y'all well, notice that there's I mean, still just something's and, and wrong. Just that, that means y'all didn't kill the right beholder. We're just gonna go back to the king with proof we killed the beholder. Though. Mm-hmm. All right, so you're still going back to the kingdom? Yeah, we're still... You're going through the desert or th- over here past... Um, I want to go through the desert. Well, I think we passed through here last time and got ambushed by a cyclops, so... That was a random encounter, though. That was a random encounter. Yeah. I think it would be wise for us to go this way. All right. Because... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, God. Alex, roll a d20. Oh. Charlie, you're playing the fire here. I roll a 20, so... 15. <laughs> We're safe. Please tell us no. Charlie, last no. Last time he rolled a 15, he just gave us the freeway. No, last time we rolled a 15, he gave us a banshee. Was it a 15? No, that was a flying sword and rogue. So, as of right now, that right there is going to just be nothing. For a little bit. Since y'all already fought that 19 roll again. Son of a bitch! Three. It's a one. I am running. So Wait, is that the Banshee? That's the dragon. We've already got the dragon I'm captain. Gonna, I'm gonna pass that one to 19 again, roll again. <laughs> okay. You do it! 20. Oh my god. You find a abandoned card of loot. <gasps> yeah! I looted. Each one of y'all gets a thousand gold. Okay, hold on. Two health potions. Hold your bitch horses. I got bitch horses now? Yeah. I thought I just had stupid yeah, I have to Okay, hold on. Uh, three healing pots. Yep. Okay. What else? Did you already have the money? Yep. And if you want some wood, there's some wood. I mean, we were talking about well, wood. We, we got, I, I, okay. I think we got enough wood. 
Okay. So that puts you there. I think I should start 20, rolling. you, someone roll. I will. Okay, Josh. 14. That is... Ooh. Ooh, let me turn to a new page. Okay. Turn to a new page. Turn the camera off. Well, this yeah. is about to get x-rayed. Yes, don't worry about it. What are you talking about? All right, so that's not the party. Oh, and um, if I can get like a sharpie, please. No sharpies for Charlie. Um, Matt, there's a sharpie in that table somewhere. Where is that little like bag? No, no, no. Uh, there's a sharpie in that drag. Oh, there's a sharpie in that drawer. Drag. Shut up. Charlie does drag. Sure. <laughs> right that's here a, nice on drag. the edge of Lake Hylia. This spot is permanent now. What? Put that back in there. What the fuck is it? Y'all come across a town. <gasps> what? That is not on the map. It is filled with sick people, mostly dying. As you walk through a town, you notice that it just seems like no one there wait, is doing thank you, wait, Josh. Wait, wait, wait. Do thank we, you, Josh. Do we have to go through the town? Yes, you stumble into it as you random encounter. So you're already in the town as your random encounter. You Can we choose to leave? Yes, There's you a, can. There was a point of reason. Do something there. Yes. Okay, fine. Keep, keep All right. That, that's pretty much it right there. It's a town full of sick weirdos. We I go to about. the center of it and use persuasion to talk them all over to me. No, that's well, not how no, shit works. This. None of them are able to get up to meet you in the center of the town. Instead, you have an old lady wave you over and with as much energy as she has. I go over to her. She's like, please, sir, can you help us? We had this doctor come through, and ever since he's come through, everyone has been terribly sick. Can you please go fetch him from the graveyard and tell, tell him that nothing has changed and he needs to come back and help us? Is this my city? Wait a minute. A doctor working in a graveyard? That's just where he's staying right now. I don't know. That, that doesn't sound like a doctor. That sounds like a necromancer. Or a plague doctor. A plague doctor. Because they are sick. <sighs> Fine. Let's go! Alright, so. Alright, uh, well, what, what do you say? I say I will go to him and I go to check it out. Alright, so you go to the graveyard. Now I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna pull pyro fields here. Oh, dear. So we got God. things up here. So, you go to the graveyard and you just find a normal, small shack. If you ever played Zelda Ocarina of Time. Mm-hmm. So, no, you haven't. Okay. So it's pretty much a small shack like in that game, pretty much, where there's nothing in there but a bed, a table, and a book. And then there's the doctor. He's sitting there on the foot of his bed. His everything off except for his cloak. And that's, that's all he's wearing is his cloak, pretty much. This guy's a fucking cultist. Uh, no, he is not. He looks like one. What kind of weirdo goes naked in a cloak? Cultists. Cultists go naked. Since I was in town the other day on business, I didn't see any mysterious. I'm sorry. Um, sorry, this has changed since. I've heard rumors of a plague going around the land, recover, uh, land recently. So I wore my protective gear, though I fear it has done me no good, for I have been feeling a little down recently. That's all he says to you, Charlie. You do realize we didn't even go in and I, talk to him at all, right? Oh, did you not? I don't think we ever agreed we were going to go no, in and meet this nutfucker hiding say, in a cloak. Let's just say we did. Okay. But, uh, Charlie... I'm sorry, I thought he went in. Charlie? <laughs> what is about this it? the place where I think it is? Sure. Alrighty. I use finger of death. On the plague doctor? Yes. Roll your cast. I'm sitting 17. there watching from the doorway. 17? You simply just breathe on him and he falls over dead. So... You I didn't have... even get to finish casting your spell. Alright, I go to the village. Uh... This hold, on, hold on, hold on, Everyone um, gets a healing pot for that. I don't take the healing pot. Okay, and that's fine. This this this. Do I have to buy a new cow going for the same pot? This, this nope, you don't. me and Charlie talked about this. This, this is a certain village. Actually, this right, this village was designed before you talked to me about it. This, oh, this, so it just became designed for me. This no, stinks of after trickery. After sure. This. All right, so he's dead. Y'all completed that quest. 
Mm-hmm. That was the shortest and dumbest quest I ever came up with, by the way. Alright, I go... I didn't specifically have the Plague Doctor in the game. Is there some particular reason... What? Well, what do we do now with the... I, well, he wants to go back to the village. Well, obvious reasons. Let's go. Okay, you go. You walk into the village. Yes. I use finger of death on everybody. Okay, roll. I'm sitting there watching. Seventeen again. Okay, a perfect twenty. Perfect. Yeah, great. You kill everybody, and then you realize none of them get up because they were already dying. Even the ones that did get up just fell back over dead. But they come back. And but they're they, supposed to. They died of the plague. Yes, but they're oh dead. my god, I know what you're doing! No, we're not doing that. You know what this ability does, Charlie. No. There's nothing they like... Have, they get no attributes or disputes from when they were alive. They are just a humanoid slave. Yes, but they have to still be alive. They don't actually die. You don't raise the dead. Finger of... On the thing that we searched up, it literally says... If I kill someone with finger of death, they come back as a humanoid. Oh, no, that's right, yeah. But they still yeah. fall back over you're letting him, they do have a You're small letting him make health. this nonsense, aren't you? No, no, he, he actually is right about that. But no, they do carry over this plague, and they all die. Shortly after. You're the one that told me that they did it. Come up. You changed the script. No, the script tells how it's always been. No. They were all going to die to begin with. No, that was not the script. All right, so random encounter over. One more encounter. Can we loot everything in the village? Yeah, go ahead. Well, I'm not touching what's, a single what's thing. left in the village? You uh, might get the plague. Will the plague affect lizard, lizard folk? No, there, you won't catch the plague. Oh, yeah. Would I catch the plague? Yes. Oh, no. So. Yes. Well, actually, no, no. Orcs basically thrive on plague. They're mushrooms. Mm-hmm. All right, so um, he might though. He's, he's only dragon half bone. dragon. That's true. Um, all right, so but I am unaffected by poison at the moment. That's not, not poison. the plague. Poison or plague, but whatever. All right, so you found a few um, golden necklaces. Okay. So what's a few? Uh, let's say two okay. in your inventory. Josh finds a uh, steel ingot. In one of the houses. So, in, in other words, we're just, we're just. You're grave robbers now. Yeah. And Matthew gets. We're despicable human beings. Yes, you are. Matthew gets. I want slaves. You don't get slaves. You already told me that when we got there to kill everybody. Uh huh. And and I thought I was gonna get him as slaves. That's how you worded it. Matthew, roll a. One, two, three, four. Oh. Why the fuck am I rolling? Roll a d6. Hey, roll a d6 for how much dick you have in your mouth. Yes, that too. This evening, do you get the plague or not? Actually, everybody roll a d20 on top of that. I'm what is the d6? Yeah, roll a d20 first. Yeah. I got Three. seven. Three. Seven. Eighteen. All right, so Matthew, you roll the d6. Five. This is not good. Oh, oh, oh. this no. is oh. not good. You find a book. A book. Hold on. No, I'm not done. I'm describing this book. A book. This book is purple and gold. Oh, no. Lots of swirls on it. Oh, Gems no. that are put into it. You can't take them out. Oh, no. They're, they're embedded into the book so hard. Whenever you pick up the book, you sense a powerful magic that you couldn't sense until you touched it. Oh, no. That's because you're magic sensitive. Oh, no. But it's my magic sense shall uh, tell me what the book is. Um, you can't tell unless, anything about it because of how powerful this magic is. Oh it's no. so powerful, it's actually stronger than you. Oh, Don't no. look at the pages, you might die. Oh, no. <laughs> do you open the book, or what do you do? I take You'll a few die. steps back. Me too. I would suggest everyone to back the fuck up. I start running okay. the opposite way. At least get ten miles away from me. I actually, you know what? Fuck uh, walking away. I sprout wings and begin flying. Okay. I open the I book. jump away. Okay. So, <laughs> Torin opens the book. While getting miskin ready. It starts glowing in a bright, almost holiest light. Oh, I am not. You got packed to the fiend. He got packed to the fiend, and that means. No, he, he does, but no, it's not holy light. It's light, holy light. Go to toilet, it'd be different. I'll be over. Ah. Immolation. Yeah. You, so, you get this book, you open it up, and 
the light starts shining and you see some words start forming around this circle that's in between the um, binds of the book. The mm -hmm. circle of light is in, is, in, is in between the two binds of the book where the book is bound together. The book says, feed me a spell and I will feed it back. Huh? You can store magic in it and reverse it. It's... So if somebody tries to spell at you, you just do it that no. and you can reach it? No. That's all it says. I'm not giving it any fucking spells. I don't have no spells. spells. This is you, fucker. We have three spell books we ain't using. You, you think that's what it meant by feed me a spell? Uh, well, I mean, I don't know I'm about to go look at that. This doesn't matter how it works because of how it does work. It doesn't care. Okay. I guess I will. I drop one of those enchanted books at him. I pick it up and try using it on the other yep. boat. So you're not casting a spell or preparing a spell so that it does nothing. Okay, I throw it back to Alex. Okay. Oh, no. I will it use... says feed me a spell. And I will feed it back. I will use minor illusion. Alright, so you prepare the spell for minor illusion, right? Mm -hmm. You cast it and it goes into the book. The aura essence is sucked out of you and into the book and then the glow of light ch changes into a glow that is um that it represents the essence of the spell so illusion what would that be like kind of a green yes sure so it go starts giving off a green um glow and then the book closes add to your inventory merlin's book wait do i lose minor illusion no merlin's oh. book where is that from how do you spell that I don't even know what that book is. Is that from the Dungeon Masters? No, it's a custom item. Uh, I think you've spoken about Wait, it. Wait, because I know the book now, can I use my... You can still use your spell, yes. No, I'm wanting to... Reset. I want to use my... Merlin's book. Where did I... Oh, shit, what did I use? Because I'm like, well, this was all just a large steaming bag of terrible. I think... We should be moving along. I will use magic detection. Before oh no, it's going to identify. For something so worse for happens. Identify. A two plus seven, and I'll use our trick site plus ten. Seventeen, okay. So seven. you realize the book works. It'll be seventeen. It'll be nineteen. So you realize this, this is a very special book, and the book works by allowing you to prepare any spell. That is cast into it, oh! and then you could cast it. Could cast that spell back out instantly. Next time you open it, it casts it. So you gotta open it facing the way. Oh, pretty much yes. Yeah. I if test, it's like fireball, I tested out, and my thing was minor illusion that I used. All right, it casts minor illusion on whatever it's facing. But well, what does it? Do? What is the illusion? I don't know what. You what have to determine it, fucking uh, dragon. You dragon. Then whatever you pointed it at, it, it, I you pointed it at Josh. Why the hell are we you over start here? Starts looking like a dragon. We're supposed to be over here. All right, I moved it off the dot. That's oh fine. wait, if I put fireball in it, instant fireball. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. By the way, that's a legendary item. Will it break? No. Hmm. Okay, so I guess we keep going back to the castle and maybe before we're at the castle now. No yeah. encounters after. Before we do that, a sheet of fireball in the book. Okay. That's fine. You prepare to fire. Okay, and so through. we return to the castle, and I say we have come to report some things to His Majesty, to the guards. First off, the king. They, Shush. They escort Before. you to the king. The king says, "Where's one of your people, and who is this new fucker?" Uh, one of the people. You thought him in a sex dungeon. Has been teleported away magically to another world. Don't worry, they'll be back later. But I need to talk okay. to. You. I need to talk to you and give a few reports. For I'm waiting. Clearly my my task hasn't been fulfilled for my livestock of cows still looks like giant Silence! Monsters. Are you telling me the king to silence? Yes, I'm telling you to silence because these is information you need to hear. I'm listening. Okay. And I pull up the map. Uh, Cross Lake Hylia is a small sickly village that has apparently been murdered by some sort of necromancer. No, the plague doctor just brought the plague into the village and they all got saved. Including the plague doctor. Okay, if that's yeah, what you're saying. Yeah, that's what I say. Okay. Because 
a certain fucker decided to go kill crazy. <laughs> uh, oh. Also, I get what you're saying. Also, uh, in the far north, the kingdom of Eastcliff was attacked by an evil and truly destructive dragon, which leveled the entire place. We should just have like a giant front by like. It also managed to destroy this. And I hold up the robotic carcass of the dead beholder. The beholder that you told us to go kill. No, the captain of the guard told you where the beholder was. The king just said go kill the beholder that calls the curse there. Uh, it's what he was supposed to say. I'm sorry. Okay. If I got whatever. Like, whatever. So the just king said, like... unfortunately though, my like I said, my cattle is still not cured, and that is clearly not the right beholder. The beholder that flew away had big old majestic wings on it. I'm sorry. And it wasn't. A I'm sorry. Excuse piece me, of your, your Majesty. Um, did you just say wings? Yes, I did. Your Majesty, beholders do not have wings. You'll understand when. Is it, a, is it a fucking dragon? No. Is, it is, a the, is the king just a retard? No. It's not. It is actually a beholder. You will understand when you get to the next two. Is it a Bakui? I've already seen a picture of it. Yes, you have. Is oh, that Iron Maiden? Beholder. That is dumb as shit. No. They fly using telekinesis. They don't need wings. No, but this... Uh, I didn't say the wings are flapping. Now, for the town over to... On the other side of Lake Hylia... I will send some men there to investigate immediately, and if we believe that it is the plague that has been ravaging the land, we are going to burn down the entire city, and there will be nothing left. Now, for East Cliff, we don't really care what happens to them. They were not part of our kingdom. We just had guards on the outside of their city to make sure that there was nothing treacherous coming out. Huh. The dragon may have that city and the heads of its people. Now, please, get out of my chambers. I've got other royal duties to do, like taking a duty. Wait, wait, wait. But where does... Let, hold on a second. Then where the hell are we supposed to go looking for this beholder? This was the only beholder we could find. Then go look somewhere else in the... East. In the East? I had to think about that. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. By the way, who named Eastcliff? We did it. They're not part of our kingdom. Hmm. Must be some weird person on the council over there. Well, I mean, there is... Don't you point at me? There is no council anymore. There is no... There is no East Cliff anymore, according to you. And that is perfect. That is fine. That means my invasion on them will have to not happen. I get to save so many resources. Yeah, but you also lose all that iron and copper. What iron and copper? There's a ton of iron and copper there. Well, I didn't want it. I've got plenty. Whatever. I'm more interested. I, in I guess we go. Oh wait, Charlie, I got a question. All right, yeah. so y'all leave Castle Town. I guess we're going this way now. All right. Since we can't find anything. Charlie does. I just said <clears throat> east. I didn't say north or south. You said east. You didn't oh, say east. I know, but I didn't say northeast or southeast. Can the Merlin's book hold more than one spell? One. Oh no. One spell and one spell only, dipshit. Yeah! But it could be any spell. From any class that could be prepared. Oh, so I wonder what would happen if I insert my blade right through that book. <laughs> uh, nothing, actually. It would actually repel the blade. Wouldn't it hurt you? It would just, like, it'd be like two, holding two magnets, trying to hold hey. two magnets together. You'd get, it'd get it close and it would just stop. I could see Josh would come over with a hammer just tink. Now, yes, that would probably happen. Right. Just because that'd be cool. It'd be like hitting, door, now this, hitting it with this, a sword. This hand. little kitty paw here is going to scratch my neck here. Alright, so yeah. where are y'all heading? She's a fat uh, ass kitty. We we're heading that way, right? Yeah, no, we're we, heading east. So, so we head, right. I'll say we go to Alberto. Yeah. Al. A. A. Bertha? Oh, A. A. Bertha. Yeah, A. Sure. Ever Rufy. Yeah, that's probably more that's perfect. Ever Rufy. That's kind of sus. That sucks. Mm. This, this hey, I must sucks. say this. That king is kind of sus. He already didn't care about like millions of people dying. That's kind of sus. Well, ain't, I mean, ain't his kingdom. Cliff wasn't his kingdom. Still kind of sus. No, it was just a small village. I think that's an... Yeah, that's an anagram for Rutabaga. Probably is. Yeah. By the way, these lies didn't were randomly generated. Yeah. I need to pull up my Oh, shorts. wait a minute. Where did I get the... Mag did I get Merlin's book? From... Um, Sick food. 
The sick people. Sick village, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You got it from one of the houses. All right, so you're heading to Ab- 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 Abrokia? Yeah, I guess. All right. I guess let's keep rolling. Alex, roll a d20. We got now, you gotta keep in mind, there are other locations on the map to go to as well. Yeah, every time you roll a d20, you screw us over. Now, the city 11. Is <laughs> that's nothing. That's nothing. I know it's yep, nothing. That's nothing. I roll so, nothing. So you're... No, it oh, I'm rolling. No, it doesn't. I never fail. Okay. Alex, roll. Oh, sorry, Matthew, roll, since you're already ready. Seven. I hate you. Nothing. <laughs> Alright, next time we'll be Joshua's turn. Oh, you're now in every year. But still, I guess I need to find you in the map now, don't I? Yeah, yep. you do, Ben. I don't <laughs> even know where that map is. Do I even have maps anymore? Map, bitch. Button map. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He's so bony and malnourished. What did that mean? I can hold you back with one hand. He sits on me. I've bed all day. Alright, here is Aberitia. Like video games. Aberitia. Well, so do I, but I got so, muscles. Keep in mind, of course, um, they, people in the town can tell you about where you You literally just named a city Norfolk. Yes, I did. You Norfolk. Sh- no, you literally named Nor- an actual place Norfolk, and you just stole the name. Is there an actual place named yes. Norfolk? Yeah, Norfolk. Oh. There's a whole species of pine trees. Called Norfolk Island Pines. Oh, that's neat. I didn't know. Imagine not knowing. Shut up, Matt. I didn't know about the trees, but I didn't know there was a place called Norfolk already. Yeah. All right, so. Okay, there's a store, a tavern, a square, a temple, an armory, and an inn. And there's this fat shit cat who came down here and is now doing fat shit cat things. Okay, so um, where would everyone like to go? Temple. Cassie, you missed an entire city being burned down and a and a tower being collapsed. And Beholder gains. Oh wait, didn't she get one health potion? Yeah, we killed the Beholder. She gains two health potions actually. Yeah, because we got one from the Beholder and then the uh, plague doctor. We're doomed. I also have... I'll kill the only look. By the way, shouldn't we have gotten out. some kind of experience for killing the Beholder? Well, I done it you physically. Like, like physically, we did kill him. I did. I mean, yeah. really hammer. Yeah, yeah, did did we were just sitting over here like... Shush, bitch. Um, I mean, we strategically brought down a building to kill a Beholder. I've done that a seems lot. like something that would be worthy of some form of experience. Fireball. I've done a good hit. I'm doing... The- you y'all come with the tower while I just smashed his head in with a final good hit. Can beholders talk? Yes. yes. Well, we could have talked to him. No. We could have said. No, he could have got no. us as chickens, so and we'll become chickens. So they'll eat mm. us. Okay. No. 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 It's true. No. Silence your. Joshua. Josh. I will use finger and death on you and make you my son. No, nope. I don't have to accept the player. Stop Matthew. talking about fingering your brother, Matthew. Finger of death. We heard you first. Okay. All right. I would like so, to use a prison. As soon as this loads, I can tell you how much experience you all got from it. Yeah. I use but what do y'all do in the city? I what do you talk. Mean? I talk to uh, huh? my. I go um, to the. What was the? Oh um, no. Don't forget, you still got one black bomb bomb. Yeah. I, uh... So I, everyone, by the simple. way, gets 3,900 yeah. EXP for the Three 3,900! <laughs> Suspicious connection blocked, thank you. Um... I no, do okay. appreciate it. How many zeros is that? That's 3,900. Zero, zero. Yeah, 3,900. Zero, zero. Uh, yeah, any experience you get... Just tally it to the side, and we'll worry about adding it up and seeing if we level up after yeah, the session. Because you know well, we got. I just know began getting EXP after that boss kill. Yeah, but you have the same EXP as everyone else anyway. No, he doesn't. He will. No, no. Mm-hmm. Because of how we always do it. Oh, okay. All right, so. So now, Matt, where are you going in the city? Temple. Temple. What are you doing there? Is it? I'm. Um, Doing gay stuff. Is it a holy temple? Yeah, yes. Gay stuff. All temples are holy. You got the pact of the fiend. You you ain't even supposed to enter. 
I look around for runes around it. <laughs> um, so it's a fairly small town, so you don't really see many, you don't see any runes, but you see maybe a magic item or two. What type? All you see is just like a glowing ball. I go take it. Isn't is it wait, is inside it, is, the temple. Ain't okay. he supposed to be hurt going into a temple? Yeah, if he enters the temple, he I'm, starts to burn outside. Yeah. I use, I'm just going to talk back to the thing. Hold on a second. Let okay. me take a look at so it. Wait, so you said is. there are magic items in the temple. Yes. A magic item in the temple. What is the magic item? I can't tell. I'm not uh, looking really significant. Oh. I'm going to lock in Dale. I mean, I see him. I'm going to lock in Dale. Your DD oh, said, geez. please stop trying to talk to me, or I shall curse you. I walk in there and try and find the magic item. Alright, what, Josh? I walk into the temple and look for the magic item. All you see is a fork on the table. I don't you roll. roll. A fork? I grab the fork. Okay. You get arrested. I roll. Yeah, roll for sleight of hand. I got 12. What's your sleight of hand bonus? Uh, None. Where was Probably it? don't have any. Where was it? You have to think under dexterity? None. None. Uh, dexterity is a minus one. Uh, what'd you roll? A 12, so I get 11. So you got 11. Okay, so you get seen putting and grabbing it, and they're like, please don't touch the fork. That was the fork used to slay the dragon that happened to attack our city last. The oh, fuck? Don't ask. <laughs> The fork was put inside of a crossbow because we were out of arrows and we just shot it and it happened to go straight through one eye and into the brain. Ever since then, we have thought of the fork as a holy item because it was blessed by the gods. I put it in my pocket. Please, sir, refrain from putting things in your pocket. Now immediately take it out. Act stupid like I don't know what's happening. A bunch of monks start lining up at the door. You're a dipshit, you know. And the back door is locked. You are a serious fucking. Now, we will give you a chance to take it out of your pocket before we forcefully remove it. Let one of the people that can still do it. I took it out and placed it back on the table. Thank you. Now they throw you out the church and lock the door behind you. Congratulations, fuckhead. You ruined the perfectly good Temple. They lock the door of the temple. Cassie. Yeah. What do you do? I hate going to the temple. I'm a cat. I know that. That worships the dark world. I don't know why you went to the temple to begin with. I don't know. I, I, well, last time I went to the temple, it turned out pretty good. Yeah, because well, for you, though. Because I was a fucking genie. No, last time I went to a temple, I got a gold fucking chalice, you idiot. Yeah. Well, but there was that one where you got a genie. So that yeah. fucking <laughs> magical. Yeah, but those genies were no. assholes. <laughs> they really so that fucking magical. Not really. <laughs> yeah, what do you mean? It's just got penetration, is all. Penetration. Mm. Uh, uh, <laughs> it, 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 it ignores armor. An uh, armor ignores. That was literally. Wait a minute. Because I'm still just now figuring out. Okay, Alex, armor. what are you doing then? Uh, I guess I'm gonna. Wait a minute. I'm not even I looking at the right side. Huh? I lost my socks. You took them off. Did I? Yes! yes. I don't remember. You laid down and like, my socks are coming off. And I said, well, that's not my fault you're stripping in front of Alex. Uh, weird. I, I, I don't remember none of that. Because you were asleep. I don't remember that. I got it on camera. I think you're on crack. Yeah, we got you on camera. Uh, I'm just going to scope out the armory. You go to the armory, just... No, look. no, no. I'm not going into the armory. No, no, you go to the armory and you're just looking at it from afar. You're so not what, in it. You're just looking at it from what's the what's it all like? What, what what they got? Methods entry. What what's the roof look like? Any guardrails? What, what's going mess. on up there? It's pretty much um, so. It's just a building, and then of course they got some things outside to work with heated up um, plates of metal and things like that to help form it, and then they take it inside to put it all together and to shiny it up and to make minor adjustments. So it's literally it literally makes armor, and it's not just the city weapon storage. No, the smith is the um, weaponry place and the armory makes armor and the city weapon storage will either be in like the town hall or one of the two, yes, but in that one they'll keep armor. They don't have a town hall. Well, then there's not one in the town hall. If they have a town hall, that's where all of the armor and stuff is stored. They got a square. Oh, a square is just a square. Okay, then. Well, after seeing that, just useless Adventure, I decide it would be best to go to the store. 
All right, welcome to the store, my friend. How may I help you? Hey, we got some magic books we'd like to sell you. I like magic books now. There's something great about anything magical. Why are you I so hate this person so why, much? Why are you so cheery? I don't know. Ow, I just popped my jaw. <laughs> that really hurt. <laughs> Dang it, he didn't snap his neck. Mm, how painful. I don't know. It's like I've been cursed or something. I just can't stop smiling. Okay then. Okay, <laughs> buddy. Okay then. Very well. We have these three magical books for you right here that can teach spells. I'll give you fifty gold each. Final what? deal. Deal. Fifty gold. Yes. Oh, wait, I give you fifty gold. Okay, I hand you fifty gold each. Okay, a hundred and fifty gold for me. So now remember, those books cost fifty-five. So but you gave them the challenge. So what? We couldn't even use them. I know. I'm just saying. Remember, I mean, that you're not really getting that. You're not really getting the loss. So each one of those books cost fifty-five. Yes, in the black and the, market. And the those cost five hundred. Uh huh. So. So what? We weren't going to be able to unload it on any reputable dealer. It was going to be like uh, twelve books or something, and uh, not twelve. It was like eight or something. And I, I reduced it. How dare you? Some. I mean, it's a black market. You're not going to get a good deal on a black market. How dare you? So. Actually, if you're sneaky enough, you you can get a good deal on the black market. Yeah, I'm sneaky enough. I take the books without them noticing. No, if you're if you're Best good at deal. manipulation, you can Thing get a good is, deal. Thing is, though, they they all have them in like a hammer space. And they have to actually pull them out. They're actually not stored there. They have them in a pocket dimension. Just like mine. I'm just going to save this. 4,817 gold. Gosh darn gone. Yeah. All right, sir. Well, is there anything else that can help you with tonight? Today. What time is it? I don't know. I've been here for so long. It's been so long. Nope. Have fun with your Please eternal business. And I turn and walk out the door. All right, so it's... I walk in. But I have oh. info. Wait a minute. What? Oh, yeah, you came back. Oh, First, we wait a minute. I have you. something else I'd be interested in selling you. Okay. I just need to pop outside for a minute and get it back. And I walk back in with the metallic carcass of a beholder. Would oh, you... what is this thing? It's a metallic carcass of a beholder. <laughs> Why? Well, the king sent us on a, a mission to kill a beholder. Uh-huh. But the problem is... Yep. He says it's the wrong one, and we kind of went to a lot of trouble of killing this one. Uh, would you pay anything for it? We did. We um, did. I mean, they are it. a rare mystical breed. I've never seen one like this before. I'm not sure I can really do anything with this. Try taking it to someone that could work on metal. Maybe they could smelt it down and get some ore out of it and be, make it some kind of useful. <laughs> but there's nothing I can really do here. I'm just a general goods store. Okay, what about this info you were talking about? Well, I've got some info. But first, you must sit with a cup of tea. I wouldn't trust it. I have the guy just for the job right here. He did. Well, hi. <laughs> here's your cup. Here's my cup. I promise I didn't poison one of them, and who knows which one. I spin the table really rapidly and then scoff it. Okay, Did Matt, you seriously what? just pull a princess bride? Yes, I did, actually. Which one makes me immune to poisons and stuff? You know, uh, you can't rage if you're not in combat. Oh. Oh. Oh, and also, oh. this is the bad thing. If he gets the poison, he's gonna die if we won't get the info. But if he gets the poison, he should be alright. Just drink Roll both D20. glasses. Hmm? No, yeah, no, I, Just drink both glasses, fucker! Yeah, I drink both. I drink both glasses. <laughs> I shug both. So you grab them both and you just kind of throw them to the back of your throat real quick. That's kind of sus. I hate that you made me do this. I'm too smart. I uh, know, right? <laughs> You instantly start feeling a paralyzation <laughs> to your whole body. And Alex You're just... not dying, you just can't move. You fall <laughs> over. This shopkeeper grabs you by your leg and drags you into the back of the shop. <laughs> and then comes back out front. He throws your body on top of another stack of bodies of other people that have been there all day today. <laughs> and Alex is just, Alex is just gonna pretend nothing happened. Be like, He's like, right, I'm sorry happened. about that, sir. He currently passed out. He will be out tonight. So how about the information? Oh yeah, um, I hear that there are some weird creatures in the northern area of this side of the continent. Describe weird? Well, flying around and almost by almost breathing fire. And I oh. don't mean a dragon. What do you mean almost? Shut up. A wyvern? No. A vacui? 
You're knocked out, so you can't talk. Yeah, you're paralyzed. Shut up. Go back to the fertilized safe section. Go back to your pile of bodies. Hey, long paralyzed. I'm going bathroom. Okay. Right. Ah! <laughs> oh, that's a, you got that for Elizabeth, and you're already ruining it before she can even see it. I know, right? It's a flying llama. Please. All right. So, <laughs> do, do you get what I'm saying, Alex? Then? Yeah. I'm, I'm giving you a hint of where to go. Something, something to the north of here. In the northern section of this side of the continent. So, up here. Where's your foot? Stick it back up. Put your hand up there. Yeah. <laughs> I wanted to do it. Yeah, okay. I get, I get you what you say. I'm, I'm trying to... All get right, you good. Know. Have fun with the arc. And I just walk out. All right, so now everyone has to take a rest unless there's other things you want to do. Yeah, let's... I want to go to the uh, blacksmith. Okay. I walk to the blacksmith. Take off my reset on us if you can upgrade this to make it any stronger. What is it? My armor. Your armor? Well, I can make it heavier, but it's probably going to slow you down a little bit. Can you upgrade it to make it stronger? Titties. Because it's already 18 right now, and it's light armor still. If I did, you would be... Oh, wait, wait, I'm, so, I'm sorry stronger. here. How does he have 18 light armor? I Thank have you. 18 light armor, and I had to pay 10,000 gold for it. Because we all broke me. Because this, I got this at the beginning. Shows that is actually what the armor class is for. It. That's actually the armor class. Well then, how did you guys choose base leather armor? No, it's not leather armor. It's like chain armor or something. Oh. It's light armor still. It's the highest. It's the highest light armor you can get. Okay. And I, I don't remember if we did we get a modifier on we it. We did get no? a modifier. Did we? Okay. We had to roll something. Oh. Okay. We got I set it down and asked him, if, is there any way to make this a little stronger, but I will still have to be, be fat. So no, unfortunately there is not. Not without putting some is, heavier plates on Is there any enchantments I could put on this to make it stronger? Do I look like a wizard to you? You do get a beard for it. Get out of my shop. I use persuasion. Am I still paralyzed? I, yes. I use persuasion to see if... I hope he steals your organs. I use persuasion to get, try to get him to tell me where I could go to get it enchanted. Well, we don't have any kind of magic caster here in this town. The only one I really know of on this side of the continent is in the castle town. Mm. Alright, when he drank those two paralyzing potions, shouldn't he have had to try and make a constitution? Alright, I can go up. I can go. And why? That seems like something that should have been done. Well, no, because he drank both of them. He might have lied to have them both like that. So he just chugged two things with paralyzing, and he's like, he's up here like, thank God. But can I still use my lace that makes me immune to it for a moment? No, no. you're not in combat. Nope, nope. I've, I don't I've have already to got, be a, combat I've already got a story plan for it. Okay. But I don't have to be in lace. Okay. I don't have to be I go combat. Outside. Outside. Okay. I'm, I'm going to take the triceratops okay. over the yeah. ability. I go outside and use turning lace. Huh? And I'm going to... I'm gonna take the trike over to the end to actually spend the night in comfort. With I go the rest outside of the and right. straight to my fiend. All right, roll. Didn't he say? No, I'm, Never no, mind. No, what? I'm I'm rolling this one because that one's a. Every time I roll this one, I get good ones. Every time I roll that, it's. A... All right, we'll roll. I want to be able to win the pink one. Sixteen. He hears your prayers but does not. I use Charlie. No, no, he does something, Charlie. He does something. He says, because you won't stop praying to me, I will give you this. So it's 26. He throws you down a little black birdie that then starts whispering into your ears. A little black bird, not nah, demon. What did it do? Charlie. It's a fiend. Charlie, you shouldn't have done that. Why? He said, if you ever wish, if you ever pray to me again, I'll curse you. The curse is a fiend to make him insane. Oh, well. It's insanity. Is there anything? Does it do anything? No, it just drives you insane. It might give you wild magic in the... In the Later came. Okay, so me and you are both technically insane now. I was already insane. I came with it. <laughs> yep. Um, so that's what you get there. All right, and you went to, the wait. to sleep. Yeah, wait. I went to the end to lodge the trike for now and go to sleep. Yeah. I, I climb up the tree and go to sleep. Can't All right. wait, so, 12 hours pass. Josh walks out of the shop. His pants are just on backwards and he doesn't know what happened. What? That's Wait, all I'm sure. leaving it with. Sure. In other words, Josh got butt fucked. Sure. Can anyone else? Can everyone everybody? else wakes up. Y'all meet at the square. I'm like, 
who smells like lotion? Ah! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, he said it! <laughs> who smells like lotion? Charlie. Can All you... right, so what do y'all do? Alex, you have information now. Charlie. Information that no on... one else knows except you, Charlie. I don't want to go back to that store. Can anyone else see? Can anyone else see? I go me? back to the store. Hey, hey, Everyone hey, can see Lowell, it, but he Lowell, only talks to you. Does your back like hurt a little bit? Like, no, he's, he's like a little bird. Is it? Is it a little like painful to sit down? Is he Remember Bruce Sparky? Willis? Did he fall down some stairs? It's a bird like that. He will only talk to you, but everyone can see him. Everyone can hear him if he if he talks to him but other than that he's only going to talk to you he's just like my cat uh, he's your, there to literally whisper things into doesn't your, your cat give you stuff though no he just whispers insanity into my ear i go to the uh, wait can you see my thing in like here because we both like have that. one only if he talks to me uh is it like a four so, so you so have the same level fiend but can we see each other's fiends? Yes, anyone can see I it. I thought yours was invisible, though. No, mine is just looks like a cat. What? I know remember? it's confusing when we got a cat in the party I as well. I remember you yours saying... Yours is invisible. No, yeah. mine is not invisible. It's never been invisible. I remember you saying it was. No, it's always on my shoulder or hiding, but it's not actually invisible. If you look at so, it, it is there. You what color is it? It looks is just it? like a normal cat. What color is it? Black. Mean? Just oh. like mine. They're just black. So it's it just whispers like a, insanity into your so ears. So it's kind of like a shadow on our shoulders. Yes. I go to the... That's what uh, they are.